Hello there guys, Francis Gray here and today I've got a new modelling tip for you all. This is Leaf Effect and uh, basically uh, once you make uh, like say one to six scale figure kit, say like an autumn kind of setting so you may even be thinking like Hammer Horror, kind of like Dracula or Wolfman or Sleepy Hollow or something like that. Basically uh, I make my own uh, scenic scatter. So basically what you do is once you make a model and uh, You've painted the base like a like a drab grey or like a mud or something like that with little bits of green uh, you just uh, cover it with PVA glue uh, And then basically you just uh, get hands full hands full of this and then just sprinkle it on so as you can see inside, there's little tiny little bits of uh, twigs and leaves and and I, so basically it just looks like uh, autumn, I suppose. Uh, so quite a lot of people always ask me how do I recreate that. Well, it's very simple. I just buy some cheap pot puree. So uh, all you do is I've got a pack here that's open. So as you can see, it's a little bit bigger. Uh, scale then want to scale this uh, so what I do is I just take random parts and then as you can see there that's too big to add to a one to six scale diorama so what I do is I just get individual parts and then just get some sharp scissors and then just take my time and then just cut away and then any difficult hard parts that won't cut I uh, simply just throw them away and I just keep the stuff that looks like leaves and twigs the odd part might fly off because obviously uh, I'm not doing this in a control manner this is just for the video you obviously you can use smaller scissors which will help a lot more so yeah so you just basically take your time and then uh, just add it as you go you don't need a, a lot all in one go you can build up in stages and uh, after you've uh, added it for a few days you can leave the lid off if you want once the air's got to it it loses its smell so you don't have to worry about putting like like your, your models like smelling really uh, like flowery or anything like that uh, obviously once you've done or once you've finished uh, you can always wear gloves prior to this or just give your hands a good scrub afterwards and then that should take off any scent or any fragrance that's on there and then yeah just basically uh, put the lid back on store it away and then when you come to next doing your next uh, model that has leaf effect uh, just uh, add some PVA glue and scour it on and then leave it to dry and then uh, brush off the excess and then add the excess back to the pile and you're ready to go again so yeah so a very simple tip uh, works really well and uh, yeah I hope, uh, hope it proves useful for you all uh, please don't forget to click the like button. If I have any comments, uh, comment below. I usually try to reply to comments uh, pretty fast. And uh, don't forget to share this model and tip online for Facebook and Twitter, etc. Because it really helps me out, guys. And don't forget to subscribe for future model and tips. Uh, I'm Francis Gray, and I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. And see you next time. Thank you very much. And goodbye.